eBet is a gaming system company that operates across Australia, New Zealand and Southeast Asia, helping its clients develop gaming solutions, management systems and licensing operations. I'm John Treadgold and joining me today at the ASX Investor Series is the company's CEO and Managing Director, Ken Carr. Ken, welcome to FNN. Thanks very much. Nice to be here. You released your interim results at the end of last month. You've shown some strong gains. What were the highlights? We dropped a low margin gaming machines business and acquired a gaming systems business. That meant at the end of the first half, we managed to increase our overall sales revenue by 6%. More particularly, we increased our EBITDA by 17%, which reflected very much in our net profit before tax increase of 31% for the, uh, the first half. And you've done major deals with gaming managers in Victoria, as well as with the Red Cape Hotel Group. How are these deals progressing? In Victoria, very strongly, John. Um, we were targeting, through a change in the legislation, uh, venues with a total of 7,600 gaming machines. To date, we've managed to secure 5,000 of those machines across a range of venues to use our best our top of the line metropolis system. Further on that, the Red Cape Group is one of the preeminent hotel chains in the pubs and hotels market, which we'd not addressed previously, and this gave us a whole new segment to look at with our major product. Excellent. And what can we expect in terms of new ventures going forward? Well, certainly we'll be looking at new product areas moving forward. In fact, we'll be launching some new product areas in the next few days. And we're always in a very acquisitive business, um, so we're always on the lookout to see other opportunities to fill up our market space. And FlexiNet and Astute BI are acquisitions that are now integrated into your operations. Uh, what sort of contribution are they making at this early stage? FlexiNet's ahead of the original planned uh, expectations that we released last year. Very strong business. Um, in this area, we acquired 89 customers and haven't lost a single one. In fact, we've increased by another one, even though we're trying to transmission them all across the metropolis. So it's a very strong business case with lots of strong recurring revenue streams, which is what our main target is in that area. Astute has been a business intelligence business. We love it to bits, and the product tomorrow will only enhance that going forward. Carter is a new offering. What are the benefits for the company and for the clubs? Certainly for our position, we've launched Cardit about three years now and managed to accelerate that business up to about 200 venues. For the clubs themselves, what it means is it's easier to manage their members in there who are gaming and gambling and manage their memberships and also their redemption. So it's about loyalty management in there. In general, clubs who use Cardit see about a 19% increase in return to those venues of the, the people who use Cardit. So we're very, very happy with Carded overall. Good stuff. And what can investors expect from eBet in the next 12 months? Well, we're classed really as a growth business. So uh, my job is to grow the business. You know, last year we were a $40 million business. Uh, my job is to take us up to a $100 million business. So uh, I expect to see a lot more growth, probably more acquisitions and more product launches. Good to hear. Ken Carr, thank you for joining us on FNN. Thanks very much, John. Pleased to be here.